OK, let me quickly explain how to conduct matrix transpose and matrix multiplication in Microsoft Excel. Here we have three matrices. The first one is 3 by 2 matrix 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The second is 2 by 2 matrix and the last one is a 2 by 3 matrix. Before using any matrix functions, it is convenient to give names to the matrices. To give a name, select a range of a matrix and then click on the name bar which is located on the left top left corner and just type any name. I'll name this range as capital A, so I type capital A and press enter. Now this region is called A. Similarly, I name the second matrix B and the third matrix D. Okay? I don't think you can use names like A1 or B2 because such names are reserved to refer to each cell. But otherwise, you can use pretty much any names, Mary or Bob or Tom, whatever. Let's first try the transpose function. Let's transpose matrix A. Matrix A is a 3 by 2 matrix, so the transpose of this matrix should be 2 by 3. So, in order to transpose this matrix, you first, you first select a range for the outcome, which is a 2 by 3 region, and then click on the function bar. Whenever you enter a function name used to start with equal, so I start with equal and then type the function name transpose. Opening the bracket, I type A because I want to transpose matrix A. Automatically, the range of matrix A is highlighted. So, closing the bracket, I enter this function. However, this is the Excel rule. Whenever you use a matrix function, you cannot simply enter. Instead, you have to press Control Shift Enter. Control Shift Enter. This is the transpose of matrix A. So instead of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, we have 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Transpose of a matrix is just you know, switching columns and rows. Okay? Now let's try matrix multiplication. Let's multiply matrix A and matrix B. Matrix A is 3 by 2, matrix B is 2 by 2. So the resulting matrix should be 3 by 2. Again, I choose a range for the outcome, which is 3 by 2 region, and then click on the function bar and starting with equal, I type m mult. That's the function you should use to multiply two matrices. m mult means matrix multiplication. The first argument is matrix A. The second argument is matrix B. Automatically, these regions for matrix A and matrix B are highlighted. And control shift enter. Remember, you always have to use control shift enter whenever you use a matrix function. Control shift enter. This is the answer to the multiplication of A and B. What if we want to multiply three matrices, A times B times C? A is 3 by 2, B is 2 by 2, and C is 2 by 3. So the resulting matrix should be 3 by 3. 
So choose a 3x3 three three region, click on the function bar, starting with equal type M mart A and B. Unfortunately, so this matrix is named D. Unfortunately, you can't type like M mart A B D. M mart function allows you only to multiply two matrices, not more than two matrices. So in order to multiply three matrices, you have to nest M mart function. So I multiply this result of A and B multiplication. I multiply this result with another matrix D. So basically I have to nest M multi functions to multiply three matrices. Okay? And after that, I just press Ctrl Shift Enter. This is the outcome of the multiplication of three matrices. Now, in order to delete a matrix, after pressing delete, you should again press Ctrl Shift Enter. Not just Enter, Ctrl Shift and Enter. To delete a name, for a region, it depends on the version of the Excel, but in this version I'm using, I should go to insert and then name define. And here is the name manager window. I choose D and click on delete. And after that, this region no longer has name D. It's no big deal, but I think it's convenient if we know it.